Hello, I am Andy and I'm going to read to you a weekly horoscope for Sunday, uh, sorry, for August the 13th up to August the 19th and that's for you coming from Libra. So let's start with the 13th of August which is going to be a very good morning, afternoon and early evening period. Plenty of support. If you are looking for romance, you are going to hit, you are going to strike gold. So make your move, communicate, go out, dress well, look well. And morning, afternoon, early evening period, you will do well on this Sunday. Even if you are with your loved ones and your romance partner and your marriage partner, it will go very well. Morning and so then the evening and nightfall period turn even better. Very solid planets move in. And they produce for you plenty of opportunities. Again, looking for romance, you've got it. Again, if you are helping your family and marriage side, you will also do very well. Go out, socialize and enjoy yourself. The bonding will be excellent. It's such a perfect day that you can also bump into business people or if you want to be with your colleagues or bosses. Either way, all round, it's a perfect day to get what you want. The 15th of August is another very good day, morning, afternoon and early evening period. You get good news at your place of work, more money perhaps, a better standing in terms of status and somehow whatever you say, whatever you do will be well received. So communicate, ask favours in areas of career, a job or in area of business and you will do very well. Now. The evening and nightfall session, there is one planet that moves in and that's not a good planet that makes you arrogant, makes you a difficult person, makes you just attract bad news. So you can say or do something that makes you get into a bad state and of course then you are a spoiler and everything turns bad evening and nightfall session. So hour by hour repeat to yourself, remind yourself, I must not be arrogant throughout the whole day or especially in the evening nightfall period and I must not want to hog the limelight and take charge and be oversensitive and you can turn the evening as well into much better for you. The 15th of August is a very good morning, afternoon and early evening period. It's a Tuesday. You will be at work or you will be conducting business if you are in business. Plenty of good fortune comes in, good news. So you got to be active. If you just sit back and have a good day, nothing much happens. You had it easy. These planets need to be excited by your activity as well, whether it's mental activity, physical activity, verbal activity. So project yourself in every way. And morning, afternoon and early evening period, you'll find that you have made great inroads to whatever you want. Evening and nightfall period, one solitary planet that makes you stubborn, makes you dominating, moves in. So if you are socializing, that will be the spoiler. So repeat to yourself every hour in your heart, I must not dominate, I must not be stubborn, I must be flexible. And that's all you need to remind yourself to have a much better evening and nightfall period. The 16th of August is not very steady morning, afternoon and early evening period. Accidents are possible. Accidents can be not only physical but verbal and emotional as well. So be careful what you say, arguments or the way you say things, your actions are all the, the area of problems that create problems. So morning, afternoon, early evening, bad news can come. So you don't want to provoke this bad news to become worse. Just sit back, think about it, try to win friends, not make enemies. Evening and nightfall period, one planet comes and to help you find solutions where earlier you couldn't. Help you meet people who are good for you. Help you make good business contacts. Help you find romance if you want. So evening and nightfall period, this planet has some kind of energy that will help you. 17th of August, a much, much better day. And morning, afternoon, early evening periods, you get very lucky and attract good news. Whatever you do is well received by others, supported by others. So put your effort, communicate, ask favours, project your ideas, project yourself and you will make a lot of forward moves and get a lot of benefits morning, afternoon and early evening period. <clears throat> 
The evening and nightfall period is not very steady. And so watch out, don't drink too much or behave too badly or drive badly and have accidents. And you may be fooled or let up the garden path. That means fooled by people making you promises and showing how much they care for you or love you or whether they want to give you business or help you in a job. Watch out, this planet is very misleading in the evening nightfall period. But it's only one planet going against you, you've got two or three for you. So go ahead and try to get what you want, but also be cautious. The 18th of August there is going to be a totally bad day, morning, afternoon, evening and night. I want to prepare you where trouble comes looking for you in all areas of your life. Well, now you are prepared, you have heard me say that. Tell yourself, I am going to take the soft approach. I am not going to be aggressive. I will use words which are soft, a tone of voice which is soft, a body language that is soft. You will confuse all these planets who are setting you up on fire and they will leave you alone because they can't get through. And so you will be able to lessen the fury of these planets against you, lessen the trouble coming for you and even win some support. Evening and nightfall session, if you don't have to go out socializing, I'd rather you don't. But if you have to, you have to be very polite. You have to use words which are very polite as well and action which is helpful and not provocative. The key word throughout the whole day is that don't provoke trouble and drive carefully throughout the whole day. 19th of August, which is a Saturday, another not good day. You are going to be differences at differences with the people you love, with the people you are out with, your colleagues or your bosses or even with business people. And the main thing that you're doing wrong is showing arrogance, wanting to hog the limelight, wanting things done your way, being oversensitive and even imagining problems which are not there. So do the opposite. Be supportive, be appreciative, show loving and you will see that you turn around these planets who cannot get through to you and you can make the whole morning, afternoon and early evening period better. The evening and nightfall period, emotional planets move in and now you can have emotional problems. Something said, something done and the emotional area catches fire. So again, don't be arrogant. Listen calmly, leave whatever you want to say for another day and you will see hour by hour it passes. Now, I'm already Skyping and I'm charging USD 5050 for a 90 minute Skype session with me based on your date of birth your time of birth, looking at your palms while we Skype. I'll be face reading you as well while we Skype. I can use Kabbalistic tarot if you want as well. I will concentrate on your next five or six years in all detail. I will go age by age for your next five, six years, calendar year by calendar year. And all areas of your life I will go into. So go to Facebook, go to Skype, send me an email if you, if you can and ask me questions and let's get down to getting your next five or six years right. Okay, until then, thank you and good luck.